Among the dozens of varieties of figs cultivated in the world, one variety has distinguished itself and created the reputation of an entire region in Tunisia. It is the story of the Jebba fig, which is today the first fruit with a protected designation of origin in Tunisia. Jebba is a mountainous village whose remains date back to the Neolithic era. At an altitude of about 850 meters, the Gura mountain plateau extends with its bare limestone layers, multiple water sources and cliffs over 40 meters high. Below the slopes of the Gura mountain lies the village of Jebba. Called Thijiba Bure in antiquity, later administered by the White Fathers, the village remains known for its orchards of fruit trees. The Jebba fig tree has been cultivated there for many centuries. A gourmet fruit and full of sunshine par excellence, the fig is known for its nutritional benefits. Rich in dietary fiber, vitamins and minerals, it has antioxidant properties. The Jebba fig distinguishes itself by its exceptional taste, unique aroma and subtle floral fragrance. In Jebba, everything revolves around the fig. Its production represents one of the main economic activities of the village. 800 farmers and their families cultivate more than 25,000 fig trees. The local variety of Buhuli figs is unique in the world and represents the pride of the village. It has developed thanks to the particular microclimate that characterizes the region, its multiple sources of clear water and an ancestral irrigation system that dates back to the Andalusian times. As recognition of its uniqueness, the Jebba fig has been granted a protected designation of origin PDO, French abbreviation AOC. The PDO is an official label awarded by the Ministry of Agriculture, guaranteeing consumers the authenticity of a product. This label certifies that the product comes from a particular terroir and know-how. The PDO aims at preserving the traditional production methods as well as the geographical specificities and at protecting the biodiversity, climate and environment. This label also helps to protect the product's reputation, promote its marketing and thus improve producers' incomes. The PDO can be used by all farmers in Jebba who respect the specifications and quality standards. The National Institute of Standardization and Industrial Property, INOPI, is responsible by law for external audits to certify the fruit, while a producer's association in Jebba manages the PDO on site and checks traceability. The labelling of the Jebba figs with PDO started in 2014. Since then, the region's farmers have been engaged in promoting this emblematic fruit of the region. The approach to promoting the PDO goes far beyond simple labelling. Behind the PDO lies a spirit of continuous improvement and a desire to highlight traditions to build the future. The PDO labelled fig is marketed all over the world. A large part of the production of Jebba PDO figs is produced for export. In Tunisia, the labelled fig is distributed on local markets and supermarket networks. The promotional activities around the Jebba PDO figs have been expanding in recent years, both in Tunisia and abroad. As part of the National Promotion Programme for Tunisian Local Products, the Jebba PDO fig is being positioned on niche markets. All activities to promote Jebba PDO figs are developed by the General Directorate of Agricultural Production within the Ministry of Agriculture and the Interprofessional Grouping of Fruits with the support of the PAMPAT project that focuses on market access promotion for typical agro-food products. The PAMPAT project is being implemented by the United Nations Industrial Development Organization, UNIDO, and financed by the State Secretariat for Economic Affairs of the Swiss Confederation, SECO. The dynamism created around the Jebba PDO fig has also encouraged the development of processed products. The women of the village have joined forces to produce sun-dried figs, fig jams and fig pastes, according to the quality standards required by the market. In the heart of the village, these by-products are offered to visitors in the local shop, Les Delices de Jebba. 
Aware of the village's potential, the Ministry of Tourism and Handicrafts and the Tunisian National Tourism Board, ONTT, have also become associate partners in developing alternative tourism in Jebba. Jebba is located only 30 kilometres from the well-known Roman archaeological site of Dugga. This provides a great potential for the integration of the village into tourist circuits in northwest Tunisia. In addition to the enchanting landscape, the uniqueness of the Jebba fig offers a particular interest for alternative tourists. Jebba has become a model of success that shows the impact of the PDO label in creating economic and tourism dynamics in the region. The fig as a flagship product has made the village famous, has improved the reputation of Jebba and has attracted more and more visitors. The PDO has also made it possible to develop cultural activities. Every year in July, the inhabitants of Jebba organise the Festival of the PDO Fig, an event that is gaining growing momentum. The staging of the Jebba Fig through local recipes is a key vector for the valorisation of this local product. Gastronomy has indeed an almost unlimited potential for innovation and creativity. Many uses of figs in the kitchen are yet to be discovered. The unique taste of the Jebba Fig has become a source of inspiration for the greatest chefs in Tunisia. Through innovative dishes, gastronomy professionals contribute to showcasing the country's agro-food heritage. The Jebba fig has become a symbol of hidden wealth in the regions of the interior and has brought together different national actors around a common goal to make a local product a real lever for local development.